Welcome to CabSat 2017 in Dubai. In Broadcast is here at the 23rd show and is the ideal showcase for everyone involved in digital media and entertainment. Hi, I'm Ashley Blankenship with In Broadcast. We're here at CabSat 2017 in Dubai. Joining me is Chris from TSL Hi. Products. Hello. Hello. So what is the latest with TSL Products? Um, the latest in terms of the market is that things are going very well. We've, we've, Business we've had, is going good. We've had very good growth over the last 12 months and it, it's all looking quite good ahead. We're a bit paranoid because you never know in times of change how that's going to be. But um, as a company, we've got 80% of what we do goes for export from the UK. Uh, there isn't a country in the world that we don't sell to and um, where one country's up another region might be down but overall um, because we're everywhere we're kind of hedged in terms of that. Very nice. So, so what are you noticing are the latest marketing trends? Well everybody's talking about IP of course um, but in fact there's still a huge need for uh, SDI in the market and uh, the big problem that all the broadcasters are faced with is how can I sweat my existing assets and at what point do I start to adopt IP based technology um, and it's a big problem for them because they've invested a lot of money in SDI, which, by the way, works really well. Um, so I'm, they're looking for hybrid products. So to address that at TSL, we've developed a range of audio monitors that will take both SDI, AES, analog, plus also uh, IP, 2022-6, or audio for IP with Dante, Ravenna. And you know what? Maddie's making a comeback as well. So... Uh, it's great, it's a good time actually, uh, helping our customers through the maze. Um, and they're all really finding it quite tough. As well as that, they've got a lot of um, stresses in terms of reduced revenues. Marketing revenues are variable as uh, advertisers find new ways to spend their marketing dollars. Um, so they're all looking at ways for doing, doing more with less. And whereas once upon a time, it would have been great to have done um, fantastic, interesting engineering things with new technology. Uh, now it just needs to be good enough, you know. So the opportunity to be imaginative about new engineering solutions is actually in decline as everybody's being much more pragmatic about content creation. So we have to respond to that. I mean, one example is the, uh, our latest monitor, which we're launching here at uh, CabSat, uh, is an SDI monitor. Uh, okay, nothing new about that, nothing groundbreaking, except maybe that it's probably the cheapest and smallest in its class with great sound quality, but at a, a new price point that means it's really affordable. So we're helping our customers make that transition. We certainly like that. Are there any other products that you're highlighting here at CabSat? Um, our new, our control system, uh, and it's called Tallyman, is a misnomer because it does so much. Um, our virtual panels are getting more and more powerful, uncovering all the, uh, some of the more complex control functions it can do. It's IP ready as well. So we're actually showing that here um, with many more control protocols, uh, Ember Plus, so we can control and increase the number of third party equipment. And that's what our customers want. Of course, so I'm sure people will want to know more and see more about this. What's the website they can go to? Uh, they can find that on tslproducts.com. Okay, tslproducts.com, check them out. Thank you so much, Chris. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, I'm Ashley Blankenship with In Broadcast.